What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back in again with another video. So, I wanted to talk about this. Obviously, you guys know I love me some sneakers. I love me some kicks, especially Nikes and especially Nike Air Maxes. So, when I found out that Lil Nas X was going to have his own custom shoe, I was like, okay, cool. Let me check this out. This also coincides with his recent video that he dropped, uh, I want to say maybe a couple of days ago. And a lot of you guys have been asking us to check it out on the In The Clutch page. Um, we kind of seen like some screenshots and people talking about it on social media and how apparently... He's giving Satan a, a lap dance. So we were kind of already not really looking forward to even checking the video out. I think we were going to kind of pass on it and really focus on other videos that you guys wanted us to check out. But when I found out Lil Dons X was dropping, you know, some Air Maxes, I was like, all right, cool. Let's see, you know, so let's see what's going on. And then I saw what was going on. And then it, it made sense on why he dropped it the timing of this release and it also kind of reassured me and dub on why we're probably not gonna check out uh that music video um apparently he's dropping some satan shoes yeah um i'm not gonna lie to you i'm, I'm i don't know how to feel about this uh if you go on Twitter, you see right now, I got the image already pulled up. It's the six out of 666, like 666. I'm guessing that's the, the, the number out of 666. They got the Luke 1018. If you look it up, it, it, it talks about uh, Satan himself. Um, on the details right here, it says the Nike Air Max 97s contain 60cc ink and one drop of human blood huh so the air bubble is filled with ink 60 cc's of ink and then one drop of human blood for that uh oh so satanic uh vibes um 666 pairs have individually been numbered that's that's obviously and coincides with the number of the beast so they're, they're only dropping that many pairs um the price of it will be one thousand eighteen dollars so pretty much your majority of your stimulus check you'll you'll have some change if you want to buy some more satanic type uh clothing to match your satanic shoes and it's supposed to be dropping on march 29th i'm not gonna lie to you it's a no-go for me it's and the shoes look sick it's just take off the 666, take off the pentagram on the shoelace, take off the Luke 1018. You can have the little red dye in the shoe, the red ink. Just take out that one drop of blood, human blood, and I think the shoe would be fire as hell, bro. I think it would be dope, but, you know, just get rid of the satanic part. Let's go click on the next image. Like, yeah, that's cool. Just still, you know, satanic part is kind of wild and then this yeah you got the the scripture loot 1018 and then it, it's this is just this is the box uh yeah <laughs> uh no I, I don't even know how to feel about this like i'm just you know and uh you know i i am a christian you know saying so i believe in god i believe in jesus uh but this is even if, even if you don't you don't believe in God, you know what I'm saying? Like it's still, it's just it's just like a creepy imagery. I'm I'm not just really fond of honestly. Um, yeah, that's the complete box. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting stuff. Uh, these will be the pair of shoes I do not get, <laughs> and I love Air Maxes. You you can see some of them in the back, like my whole room is filled with air maxes and then you know i have my jordans in the case right there you know what i'm saying like i love me some air maxes they're comfortable they come in different like different colorways like it's 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 one of my favorite type of shoes to get you know what i'm saying but this right here is just uh i don't know about that uh i'm about to pass on that one man 
And like I said, I know it, it coincides with his music video he recently just dropped, you know, with the devil satanic imagery in the video. Um, but yeah, it's just, it's not for me. Me personally, this is not something I, I would be a part of. Um, obviously, for those who don't know, Nike's not involved with this. You know, this is not the first time a controversial shoe that deals with religion that was using Nike's products was actually created. Um, the, the company MSCHF, they you know they do custom custom lines of you know Nike shoes, and this is not the first time. Actually, these came out. I want to say in 2019, the Jesus shoes. And they're filled with holy water in the soles, and right now they're selling for over four thousand dollars on like StockX. But originally, at the time, they were roughly the same price as the little Nas X shoes. And they're basically these came out in 2019, and they're basically the little Nas X shoes, one for Jesus and one for Satan. Um, the same company, they pretty much get. Air Max 97s at retail price, and then that's when they they completely like customize it. And right here, MSCHF also source holy water from the River Jordan, which was blessed by a priest in Brooklyn and added added to added to the soles of the sneaker. That's that's pretty much the the little Nas X rendition of it. You know, what I'm saying you see right here they have a, a Jesus pendant. Or whatnot instead of a pentagram and then also they have the the water the holy water that's blessed like i'm not even gonna lie to you these do look clean don't get twisted these look hella hella clean but at the same time it's just like you know you know it, it definitely uh i remember at the time it definitely kind of upset some uh people in the uh in the christian community like as as this being something blasphemous but it's just one of those things this is not the first time this company has done this before so nike has no involvement in this at all nike's not selling this shoe these are you know limited release customs that people want these are cool. I'm not even gonna lie to you. They they are pretty dope. And I can see myself probably wearing this way, way more than uh these right here. I'm I'm gonna just keep it a keep it a stack with you. You know what I'm saying? Granted, I wouldn't pay that much for a pair of shoes. You know, I'm not paying over a thousand dollars for a pair of shoes. I don't care how much money I obtain. I'm just not doing that. That's just me personally, man. So yeah. Not gonna lie to you, uh, this is just, it's a little bit extreme, not extreme, but it's just, it's not, it's not for me personally, so, yeah, these are a pair of shoes, a pair of Air Maxes I would not want, it's like, if you put these shoes on, like, you just transform into a different individual, like, you just become more violent, more aggressive, like, your evil side comes out until you take the shoes off, that's how I feel like if I was to ever get these shoes, I would just be on just this evil like mindset like i would want to like kick puppies and shit like that you know what i'm saying something pure evil like i nah keep them away from me i'm okay with the collection i have right now so comment down below let me know i want your honest opinion would you rock the satan shoes let me know we don't have to get into an old religious talks i just want to know if you would actually rock these shoes Comment down below. Let me know. I would love your thoughts and opinions. Appreciate all the love and support. Road to 40K. Appreciate y'all kicking it with me. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.